Good morning, it's day three in Utah. It's 9.36. We're gonna go to Old Cuss Cafe. It's like a plant-based style shop. We are not vegan or vegetarian, but it just looks really cool. And they also have a like vintage shop inside of it. So I really wanna see it when we're here. Little change of plans. Today happens to be the only day that Old Cuss Coffee is closed. But I did find this other place called Alchemy Coffee that looks pretty good. They have some seasonal drinks. They have like a gingerbread latte right now, which I'm uh, HOE for gingerbread. We're gonna try that. We have arrived. It looks pretty cool. So let's hope the coffee is good. All right, we got our drinks. We both got drinks from our holiday menu. I got the Dancer. It's the gingerbread latte. Got a little bit of cayenne in it, which is interesting, but it's not like too spicy. Adam got the Dasher, which I don't even remember what was in that one. White mocha and nutmeg. And I tried it. It's actually really good. And then I got a ham and cheese croissant. Probably can't see it, but it looks really good. Adam got a breakfast sandwich. Came with like fruit and stuff. It looks really good too. Now we are going to the Antelope State Park. Heart, hoping to do some hiking there. Apparently they have a lot of bison, so maybe we'll get to see some bison. We have entered the Antelope State Park. Beautiful that is. Holy cow. I've got my new hiking shoes on. They're very colorful. I'm excited to put those to use today. Let's go to the visitor center because your boy got a pee. Yeah. these little sheets where they give you different range recommended hikes we're gonna do the one at the bottom all these in this category are supposed to only take one to two hours we're not usual hikers it might take us a little bit longer I jumped in the back seat and rolled the windows down just so I could get some better views on both sides. We've made it! Let's go hiking! made some progress but I'm absolutely exhausted all right I'm not sure if you can tell though but like that's water all the way in the middle but I'm assuming because of how much the lake is dried up on the outside all like the tannish color that used to all be water but now it's just salt it's crazy how much it's dried up I can definitely attest to this thing for the week though Woo, climbing these hills is rough but we're having a good time we wanted to make it to this rock and we made it Made it on top of this rock, which was our goal. Natural trail we followed took us, I think, somewhere like right over there. We came from all the way down there, but we walked all the way along here and up to this giant rock, which is a beautiful lookout. Oh shit, it's a video. 
<laughs> We're about to hike back down, which should be easier as long as I don't fall and roll down and break every bone in my body. Wish me luck. We officially made it back down. So we have made it to the end of the island, or at least as far as it'll let us go. It's got it locked off over there, so we can't go any further. We found this little ranch. Fielding Gar Ranch, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Adam's using the bathroom at the moment, but once he's out, we'll go down more into the ranch and see if there's anything down there. So we found a little wagon. This is where the bed would be. It's like some pots and pans, stove top, Adam. So I'm not super sure what this is. The old like washing boards, toilet, and this is like the main part of the house, I guess. Got an old table, your oven, this old washing machine. Looks like an even older washing machine. <laughs> oh, camping water bag. It's a pretty big table. That's cool. Got another room in here. There's a couch, day bed type thing. Now we found a little basement area that Adam is walking down. Cellar pantry looking thing. Now we're gonna go in the upper area of that same building which looks to be just like a little living place i'm not the best with history so i'm sure if anybody's watching this is super smart with history you'd more know what this is but it looks like it's got four little beds there used to be water in here and there's the little spot over there in the corner where the water would flow in so that they could come in here and get water to take up to the house to use because there's a little spring creek area outside which is dried up now but it looks like there used to maybe be flowing water you learn something new every day don't you <laughs> now i'm super excited because i found horses y'all are so cute overall though super freaking cool area i don't think either of us knew we were gonna see a little bit of history out here. I don't know a lot about it, but I do enjoy seeing stuff from history. I think it's really neat. So hopefully y'all enjoyed it too. We're about to head back to the car and see what else we can get into. Found another sea of buffalo. Look at them all. Hi, buddy. It is now a little while later. We've hydrated and everything from our hike. Had a little snack. Now we are at the Capitol building. I know you can go in. I've seen people go in on TikTok. So we're going to see if we can figure out how... from everything we looked up that you do have to have a tour schedule to go through it. Regardless though, it's a really freaking cool building as you probably saw from the previous footage. Getting dark, couldn't figure out much else to do, so we went to the City Creek Mall. This is actually the coolest shopping mall I think I've ever seen. Found a candy store and I've never seen so many flavors of these cookie dough bites. They have red velvet, cinnamon bun, peanut butter. There's also like a s'mores version of it. They also have these fridges of all these different flavored sodas. It would be so fun to do a video of like trying all these y'all this shopping mall is like from a dream do you see all these lights look at all these lights here they have a ginormous wreath it's so beautiful oh my god i'm literally just like blown away at all this this is crazy we stopped in Nordstrom, it has a e-bar is what they call it, and it's a coffee shop. Me and Adam are sharing an eggnog latte. We're headed to go eat dinner. I found a place called Vertical Diner. It's like an old school diner theme, but it's like vegan. We have made it. They have artwork on all the walls and you can Venmo the artist and take it home. We just got our kombuchas. Adam's super excited about them. I got a tofu scramble with potatoes and some toast and some delicious jam. Adam got the chicken fried steak and it came with with Brussels sprouts and broccoli. It looks pretty good too. All right, we just left Vertical Diner. It was really good. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because now we're just headed back to the hotel room. It is eight o'clock. I will see you guys bright and early tomorrow for day four in Utah. Y'all have a good night or day or whatever time you are watching this. Bye. Mom, somebody just followed me.